This is a Chinese classical and folk, folk dance group founded in 2006 by a group of dance lovers, Chinese dance lovers. Um, and we have our weekly rehearsals at the University of Pennsylvania. Um, we have several performances in the past. We have participated in the NBA halftime, um, two times or three times, I think. And we have our Chinese Lunar New Year celebrations each year. And so we have a, the annual gala show. And this year is going to be in April, and I'll talk about that later. The first one is the Chinese classical dance. It's originated from ancient China, and it started from uh, several dynasties several thousands ago. And uh, we have long sleeve dance, like this one. And we have fan dance. We didn't bring fans here. And we have sword dance. And we don't have swords now because it's so dangerous. Um, and the music usually are played by Chinese instruments. Our first dance is called Highway. Um, as you can see, our performers are here are um, already in that costume. Um, that's a Chinese uh, classical dance um, from a musical called Confucius. Does anyone know Confucius? Okay, who's Confucius? Um, he was an ancient Chinese philosopher um, whose philosophy uh, kind of is still like well regarded today. Excellent, that's right. Um, and this is this dance is uh, from Tang and Han Dynasty. Um, so it's about three thousand years ago, I think. And um, so I guess that's enjoy. <laughs> Yeah. 
The second one, the genre is called Chinese folk dance. Um, as you may already know, we have 56 ethnic groups in China, um, and uh, including the Han, Han group, it's a majority, and we have 55 ethnic minority groups. For example, Zhuang, uh, Iger, Miao, Tibetan, etc. Um, each group has its own culture, costumes, food, um, language even, um, and also a different type of music and dance. The next dance is called Flower in the Rain. And this dance is in the Dai Asis area, which is at the southeast part of China. This dance describes a young girl um, of Dai. Um, feels rain when she takes a nap and then happily plays in the rain with her umbrella because as you may know um, that part of China is very hot like warm I guess um, so if the rain falls down um, everyone's very happy about that um, young girls from the Dai ethnic group often dance with bright and lively music to show their happy mood so that's in true.
business is from the agriculture um, that's in the north uh, northwest part of China, and um, that part is called Xinjiang Province. Uh, singing and dancing are part of either people's daily life, and it's a way to welcome visitors. The Scarlet Flower celebrates the love between the soldier and the princess in the northwestern China. And Xinjiang is a really beautiful place, scenic place in China. So if you ever get a chance to visit China, that's the place you will have to go. <laughs>
，他就这样。<笑>